Dear students, let us solve this interesting question. Find the value of square root of 50,625 and hence find the value of square root of 506.25 plus square root of 5.0625. So let us solve this. We have to first find the square root of 50625. So, we will be marking the periods from right to left. Now, here we are left with single digit 5. So, we will look for a number whose square is less than or equal to this number. So, 1 square 1, 2 square 4, 3 square 9. So, we will come back to 2 square. So, 2 into 2 is 4. 5 minus 4 is 1. Take out the next period which is 0, 06. 2 plus 2 is 4. Now look for another digit which you will place after 4 and multiply with the same digit to get a number less than or equal to 106. So I find it that if I multiply 42 by 2, I get 84. So 6 minus 4 is 2 and here it is also 2. So take out the next period which is 25 and 42 plus 2 gives me 44. Now look for another digit which I have to place after 44 which will be multiplied by the same digit to give me a number less than or equal to this. So if we multiply 445 by 5, let us see what we get. Because you see at the end I have 5. So I am just guessing it. So let me see. 445 multiplied by 5. Okay, it is coming out to be 2225. Perfectly fine. Subtract it. So you get 0. So, this means square root of 50625 is equal to 225. Now, in this question, using this value, I have to find the value of 506.25 square root of this plus square root of 5.0625. So, I can write it as square root of 50625 divided by 100 plus 50625 divided by 10,000. You know I am removing the decimal and uh, writing the digits like this. So this is equal to, now what is square root of 50625? You know this identity under root of A upon b is under root of a upon under root of b provided b is not equal to 0. So, here a and b both are perfect squares. So, here this is 50625. So, I can write it as 225 because I have to find the square root and square root of 100 is 10 plus 225 divided by and uh, this becomes 100. So, this is equal to 2.25 plus 2.25 is for the second term. Plus for the first it will be 22.5. So, 22.5 plus 2.25 gives me 24.75 which is the final answer. I hope the question is clear to you.